everybody. Here is the video for my MCD XR5 brushless 20S. Yes, you heard that. I try to make not a faster but a longer running time perform and good with a good speed with a decent speed and for a long time so I choose to put in the MCD 20S so I made some mod with the help of Rivia Prod that's a guy in French he has a company which helped me to make some piece and uh, we developed some ID to make lighter and easier uh, way to put in brushless this magnific beautiful car you know, isn't it I'm really 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 love this so first things I decide to put out the side of my roll cage this is ready but I only will drive it on the road so the flip is very 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 rare for this kind of car because it's very large it's very easy easy so we hope you are doing not doing some flips so the, we gain almost 500 grams with this modification if I wanted I could also Cut it here, cut it here, cut it here, cut it here, and just keep it the uh, body, the body intentions. But I want to make the modification. I can do uh, in reverse time. So for the moment, I just try to remove this thing. Then we are remove also the side of the car because it's very e heavy and we also gain 400 gram grams for this car so we are nearly one kilo left from the side from this side then we are developing some brand new uh mount for the brushless which is like one eight scaled with a direct pinion and gear on the diff uh, which avoid this complicated system using the motor the gas uh, using the gas motor mount this one it's a brushless and the major thing it's in stock with eight millimeters hole for the for the motor me i'm using a 10 millimeter uh, shaft motor brushless motor this is a sss uh, motor with 240 kv and uh, 56 one to three of the side so this is very few because we are remind remind reminder we are in 20s so normally with 20s and this kind of KV, we are around nearly 20,000 turn per minute on the motor. It's equivalent, mostly equivalent, of a 32cc gas uh, motor performance. So I don't want to go fast, I want to go with a decent speed, but a long, long time without any really huge and very specific lipo i'm using lipo uh, it's gen bashing as a standard i use in my max i use in my python i use in in my x mass so this is very conventional lipo which it's only weight 400 grams so here we are we can see clearly the montament so it's plugged on the standard uh, gas mounted plate with I just remove it because, with a, something which is very interesting because you can adjust the mesh 
with these plates, but also with the front side here because we have it screw. So this can slide and this can slide. So you can put every spur gear and pinion motor gear on it to test it. So we also removed the conventional drive shaft here because we remove all the brake installations because we no need we, we will use the uh, flyer model ESC brake and we use the drive shaft from the max version which is larger than the MCD uh, this is uh, four meter longer than the standard one and we remove this piece so at the end and the end we have a complete ready to run MCD with two kilos of lipos 1.3 kilos of motor at the end with all the things we have 15 kilos ready to run that's very very good because I we gain almost two kilos from the gas versions uh, I also try to test the uh, GX of the steering servo, it's a high voltage servo with 70 kilos of power and it's HV for 8.4 voltage. So it's I use an, um, a back from Obi Wing. You can set the external alimentation with the 3S LiPo here, and you can see. I'm going to show you. Oh, it's tough and it's not so ridiculous for the fasts, for the things. Uh, no, this is not my radio. <laughs> this is not this one, this is this one. So, uh, as you can see, I can push it down. And the servo is still working perfectly. So, this is cheap one. The cost is 20, 25 euros, I think so. So, very, very, very cheap. And for me, it's a very good value for the moment. It's a very good value. Um, what else? So, I use, um, I use uh, the top of this box. I cut it. And I make um, some plates here to put the ESC on the top plate, top plates. And I made some support with the tube here. I don't know if you can see this one to avoid this plate is not to avoid the movement of this plate. So, so uh, this is the. I think this is not the basic version. This is the pro but not the max, this is not the, um, the top of the, this is an intermediate uh, version of the MCD. You have the all metal gears in uh, um, with uh, limited slip differential in the middle and the front, but standard diffs, also metal, but standard diff on the rear. The, um, the hydraulic is 10,000 front and 5,000 at the rear. And the drive shaft of this beast is absolutely perfect because it's not dog bone or it is not a classical CVD like the other model. It's with some balls. I don't know if you can show you. Yep, I got it. This is the stock one we replace by a longer one. And you have some free ball you can go which can go in the cup. Like here you have the the print it in and you got with the you got free place to have the strain and the strains and it's very 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 tough. That's why you can put a lot of power in this kind of car because it's heavy so for me, it's at least five, one S per kilo. So here we have more because we want little more. 
and uh, I also put some protections on the motor here to protect, to prevent, to have some contact with the light port just here to avoid some fire <laughs> on board. And uh, that's it, that's it, that's it, that's it. I will just. We can we can try some different weight distribution with three lipo on the rear and two at the front or inverse. Here I try to make some weight at the front because it's an onward uh, onward version and I prefer this kind of weight distributions. Um, so if you want to have any question. Please comment this video, I will uh, answer you with uh, my poor English, I will try to do that. And uh, that's it, uh, yes, just last thing, for the first run, I didn't first, I didn't run yet, because it's raining, it's raining for long weeks here in France, so I uh, put 23 uh, pinion motor. 20 teeth on the motor and on the diff we have in 60 teeth so uh, that's we use in a 32 cc gas motor uh, transmission ratio so I will try this and uh, we can adjust as you know with this kind of uh, support you can adjust with a lot of uh, spur gear or pinion gear and to try to add the the, 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 eh, la, la, the speed you want and the playing time you want with this kind of thing so I hope we can make the test soon and I will make the video also so bye bye please come on share you love it, you hate it, you comment, as you know, bye bye, ciao.